Hello and welcome to News 18. We are today talking about the possible scenarios that might emerge on the 13th of this month when the counting takes place here in Karnataka. Most exit polls are talking about a fractured mandate. Well, if that indeed happens, then you will see the Congress, according to most exit polls, emerging as the single largest party. If that comes true, then the likes of DK Shukumar would fancy their chance for the Chief Minister's seat. If the Congress has to go with the GDS, then the GDS perhaps wouldn't be comfortable with the idea of either Sidramaya or DK Shukumar becoming the next Chief Minister. It will be a low-profile candidate who the party would be comfortable. If the Congress gets a clear majority, the road becomes easier for Sidramaya to return as the Chief Minister of Karnataka. The other scenario that uh, most exit polls are also talking about is BJP inching towards that 113 mark. Well, if indeed that happens, then it's not clear if Basuraj Bomai will come back as the Chief Minister. Anything short of 113, it would be inferred as the people of Karnataka not giving a thumbs up to Basuraj Bomai. So it will have to be somebody else from the BJP who will have to be the Chief Ministerial candidate. If the BJP decides to go with JDS, once again, it will be a low-key leader that the party would prefer. Well, the other option is for the na both national parties, whether it's the Congress or the BJP, to poach a bunch of MLAs and cross the 113 mark. It's happened earlier, could happen this time, if any of these parties cross 100-figure mark and they're short of, say, five or six, seven seats to reach the majority mark. Well, it will become clear on the 13th on whether we will have a government with simple majority or if politicians will have to go to resorts. In Bengaluru, with camera person Satish, Arishupadhyay.